Hey guys! So it's been a while since I've recorded a video. I ran into some financial difficulties. Um, so I hadn't been going to Dollar Tree except for the necessities, just soap and little food items for um, snacks for the kids, things like that. Um, things that I didn't think needed to be hauled and I didn't want to give you a really boring or like super small haul. So I just figured I would wait until um, things got better and things have gotten better. So um, I went into Dollar Tree for one item and ended up leaving with $21 worth of stuff. Uh, <laughs> that always happens. So, But they were all really good, fun finds and um, things I'm going to be using. Uh, there is one item I did want to show you. It's from my 99 cent store haul that I posted a while back. I couldn't find this item because I had folded a bunch of laundry. I had put it in the corner of my room. Somehow this managed to get stuck underneath the folded laundry. Um, so when I put that away, I found them and I thought, oh, I need to haul these when I do a 99 cent store haul. But I don't know when I'm going back, so I just figured I would show you now and then do my Dollar Tree haul. So, these are emoji thumbtacks. How cute are these? Sorry for the glare. How cute. These are so fun. I have a cork board in my room, so I thought these would be super fun to like hang pictures up, like with the emoji of what the picture looks like. So, um... These are a fun find. Again, this is 99 cent store, not Dollar Tree, but the rest of the haul is Dollar Tree products. Um, so I went in to buy these large vacuum bags. And if you guys have not tried these, they are amazing. They work so well. Um, they're a very large bag. They fit a lot of stuff. Um, I do blankets in mine and now I'm going to do some winter coats that we have. I do live in California and so it is sunny most of the time and we only need our winter coats towards the end of the year and like part of the beginning of the year. So all the rest of the time they're just sitting in my closet like super bulky coats taking up space. So I figure let's put them in these bags and put them under the bed and hide them. But again, these do work great, and like this picture does not lie, like this is what happens. You put these towels in, and you vacuum it out, and it looks like this. It's so good. So, um, yeah, I had to pick up like six of these because I have coats and blankets coming out of my ears, and I need to put them away. So I bought a bunch. Um, I got this paint. It's like this glitter paint. It's by Jot. It's such a pretty purple color, and I thought my daughter would love to do painting with her friends with this paint. So, pick that up. I bought these metallic markers. I took them out of the packaging already. Sorry. I think they're a drop product, but they might not be. Um, but yeah, they're metallic fine point pens. And they're silver and gold, and they do write really well. I wrote on... Um, some labels to put in my daughter's room and um, they turned out really great. So, metallic marker. Um, I got some beads for my daughter to make bracelets. Her and her friends made some bracelets a while back and they had so much fun. I just thought I had to get some more. These are different shapes. There's stars, flowers, and hearts. Um, so I thought they would really like that to go with their bracelets. And I bought some of these repeat by Welch's Fruit Snacks. There's only four in here, but they are soft and good and tasty. So um, I don't mind buying these over like the other brands that are there. So I don't think they're as tasty and they're like hard. So um, I can't remember if I shared this in my last Dollar Tree haul or not. So I'm just going to share it now. If I did, I'm sorry, um, but this is Sick Bricks. It's a little cat. My daughter loves cats, so I thought I would let her um, get this one and try it out. They had a bunch of different kinds, but again, it was a cat, my daughter's favorite. I bought these um, Velcro dots. I thought this would be nice to hang stuff up on the wall that um, 
doesn't really need a tack that could just like paper items, you know? Like that picture up there, it's being held up by tape. I figured I could put some of these on there and it would stick better than the tape falling off of it, you know, after a while. Found Mod Podge. I didn't know Dollar Tree sold Mod Podge and um, I've seen some posts on a uh, YouTube of people making items with Mod Podge, so I thought I'd pick some up and I would try it and see how how well I can do it. I got some cheese it grit. This is a repeat buy. I bought it last time. My daughter ate them all super fast, so I bought some more of those. I found some of these Futocracy. They're by Dole. They're the little fruit pouches that you squirt into your mouth. This is apple double berry. Um, we're just going to try them out, see if my daughter likes them. I've had the brand before, and my daughter did like them, but she wasn't crazy about them, but it was just the apple flavor. So we're going to try apple double berry and see if she likes it. I bought this for my wall. I have dream catchers on my wall over there. You can't see them. I have dream catchers on my wall. I really love dream catchers. And this says all you need is love, but um, it has arrows and things like that. So I thought that would be really pretty to put on the wall with my dream catchers. Um, I bought some squirt guns for my daughter and her friends when they come over. I bought this craft storage organizer. I'm going to use this for my daughter's beads that we bought for her bracelets. Here's some more beads I found. They were like, they have letters. They can spell their name or whatever um, word or words they want to put on their bracelet. And I found this lip smackers. They had a bunch of different lip smackers there. Not just the normal chapstick. They had lip gloss. They had one that was like a, a chapstick. And then on the other side, it was a lip gloss that like goes over. They were like two different flavors. You could, I don't know. And then they had these and they were the roll-on lip smackers. And I really like roll-on um, glosses. But I haven't been able to find them anywhere. So I found this one. I picked it up right away because I love roll-ons. And I can never find them. And it's by Lip Smackers. So I know it's good. And this is in the cotton candy flavor. This is the only flavor they had. But had to, had to have it. And you guys, this is the thing I'm most excited about in the last items. My daughter loves Little Crunchies by Graduates. These. They're selling these there at Dollar Tree. They're selling a bunch of different flavors. I got the mild cheddar. That's what my daughter likes. And I also picked up one of their ranch just so she can try it but they have a bunch of different flavors there like not just that they have like some of the vegetable flavors and things like that they're also selling the Gerber puffs which I was gonna grab as well but I already have like three of those at my house so I didn't need any more but they are selling those and then check this out they're selling these there they're like little oatmeal this one is um, the cereal the apple blueberry and this one is Hearty Bites Strawberry Raspberry. So, um, I don't know. This is for a toddler, and this one's for a crawler. But, um, my daughter's crawling, and she's starting to walk. So, if she can't eat this, I'll try to give her a couple bites. And if she doesn't like it, I mean, maybe my four-year-old will like it. I don't know. But... We're going to try both of these and see if she likes it. They do have different flavors there. They had some of the normal just like rice cereal. And they had the normal ones that you give like little, little babies. That has like D DHA probiotics on it and things like that. So, um, yeah. But they're selling a bunch of Gerber products. So, if your baby is into that, run, run, run and pick it up. Because they are not going to last long. I mean, I bought... I bought three... And I would have bought more if um, I wasn't on a budget. But, yeah, I had to limit myself. So, yeah. But, yeah, I hope this video helped you and you saw something that you like that you want to run to Dollar Tree and go pick up yourself. And, um, yeah, thank you for watching, guys.